not so happy homecoming for the fifth ranked UW Whitewater Warhawks. So the 10th ranked UW Oshkosh Titans came into Perkins Stadium today, defeating the Warhawks 28 to 13, marking the Warhawks first conference loss since 2008. Pre-game, the homecoming game flew by quickly, but in favor of the Titans. In the first quarter, quarterback Nate Ware connected with wide receiver Caleb Voss on five and 60-yard touchdown passes. In the second quarter, Ware connected with wide receiver Corey Whipperfirth on a 21-yard touchdown, putting the Titans up 21-0. Warhawks quarterback Lee Brecky went four of nine with two interceptions before being pulled in favor of sophomore quarterback Matt Barron. At halftime, the Titans had outgained the Warhawks in total yards 241-53. In the third quarter, Barrett and the Warhawks showed life as Barrett connected on 22 and 29 yard passes to wide receivers Joe Worth and Dontrell Wright, respectively. Warhawks had an opportunity to score a third touchdown, but the Titans defense stuffed the Warhawks offense just short of a first down at their own six yard line. In the fourth quarter, Big Mo seemed to have run out for the Warhawks. Titans running back Cole Myra sealed the deal for the Titans with a one-yard touchdown run. With the win, the Titans have sole possession of first place in the WEAC and control their own destiny to make the playoffs for the first time in program history. While the Warhawks, with their second loss of the year, their playoff forecast looks rather cloudy. I'm Sean Tian. That was the Warhawks D3 Report on UWW-TV and D3Football.com.